We're back. Thank you for your click. Ah, uh, yes. I want. Uh. I want to second that. Thank Whenever you. Whenever you for click, your click, we say ah. Uh. Oh. Yeah, because it, <laughs> it clicks us. <laughs> No. I'm sure you're familiar with Mamrie Hart. Uh, we are big fans of her YouTube channel, You Deserve a Drink. And she's also a good friend. Yeah, so we asked her to do a holiday correspondence piece for us, and she said, sure, if I could go visit a witch. We were like, we don't understand, but sure. Hello, I am Mamrie Hart, and I'm here with Maja Dawu the White Witch of Los Angeles to teach me about some magic and maybe even do a custom spell for me. So nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Oh, Maja. Yes. How long have you been witching? I've been witching a while. Yeah. A while of witching. Maybe 25 years. You kind of look like you could be either Coachella or like a chill <laughs> yoga instructor. No black. You're a white witch. Does that mean like you're a good witch versus an evil witch? With white magic, it's more about helping things, empowering people. Mm. So you're like a witch life coach. Coach. Exactly. Do people ever come to you and try to get you to do evil stuff? All the time. Tell yeah. me. Tell me all of it. <laughs> Most people really want me to hurt their boyfriends for them. Or you don't do exes. that? No, I totally don't do that. Uh, well, Instead, our time courage, here is done. <laughs> you have to be a little evil if you're going to try to deal with evil. I practice self-defense. Wow. I could kick you in your head right now from a sitting position. I wish you knew how many times in the first five minutes someone told me they were going to kick me in the right? head. I don't have a, a hateful spell. But I do have a spell that might be a little narcissistic or a little vain, uh -huh. but yeah. I want a spell that gives me some sort of extra added layer of self-control over the holidays uh -huh. so that I am good to my body and I don't get chunky. So, Maja, I did want to bring something to the mix, okay. so I brought a box of enchanted craft, and I figured, yes. might as well, a copy of the craft. Oh, very important. Okay. in every witch kit. How do we feel about Dreamcatcher? That's white appropriation of Native American culture, so we have to be careful. I didn't choose that prop, and I didn't disrespect it either. We got a Harry Potter wand. That's very white European culture. Great, you're like, let me show you all the people you're offending with your enchanted crap. I'll get my enchanted crap out of the way because I am excited to get started. How do we do this? We're gonna build an effigy of yourself. And those are called golems in some cultures. Like golem, like my pretty. <laughs> sort of. I'm, I'm not gonna lie, it's looking like we're about to do some arts and crafts. We're gonna make you out of clay. Bodies are really just movable pieces of mud, and then we kind of disintegrate back into the earth when we die. This is dark and I'm scared of death. Keep it light, white witch. That's pretty much my body type. That's totally perfect. Do you do voodoo dolls? Oh, that it was a tough sentence. That was a really tough setup. Well, this is a voodoo doll that okay. we're doing, but you can also use it to help make just a big dark hole. So that's like your belly hole. And the food that I brought. This looks like old teeth. This is frankincense. It's known as increasing fire and regeneration. Like we emit heat. Oh, girl, I'm a space heater. Put this in your belly with the intention that you increase your little stove here to burn all those calories. So I just get some freebies? A little. Right? I said too much, Masha. This is to bind your middle to keep you from going into excess. Is this also used so I can hang it from my rear view you so I don't go to in and out Stick that on your head. Crystal technology is the primary source of all of our telecommunications. Wow. Right? So we're going to take this magic crystal wand and we're just going to Wake crystallize up. your intention of not wanting to overdo it. How long will this last? Well, what would you like? A lifetime. Like, do you usually party on New Year's? <laughs> oh, Majo, you have so much <laughs> to learn about me. What if this breaks on the 31st? OK, ready? Well, pinky swear it. Does that do anything? It's totally. It's uh. with between you and me. <laughs> Promises with friends, friendship is magic. All the My Little Pony shows are true and correct. When two people keep their word to each other, that's some of the best magic that there is. Well, Maja, thank you so much for coming and uh, humoring me with my spell. I think a lot of my preconceived notions about witchcraft were just... Dispelled. Oh, dispelled. Uh, now you are expelled because <laughs> I, I need you to leave. But thanks, nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. Now that Maja has left, I thought we could test to see if the spell actually worked. So two choices for me today. Oh, great. What do we have here? This is a mushroom milkshake and a margarita. Great. I hate mushrooms. I think they are the devil's sponge. Meanwhile, we have a margarita, which is made of angel tears. So this is gonna be a tough one. This I should go for. Probably lots of protein. This, way more fun. Hmm. What, what is that? 
Yeah, it does look really disgusting. I agree with you, Tiny Mamrie. I do feel like I'm gonna have a lot more self-control these holidays. And I did pinky promise that it would last till the 31st, but I didn't pinky promise when it would start. So don't look me in the eyes, sweetie. Oh, that's good. Mmm. Happy holidays to me. Cheers. Can we get this offset? Thanks, Mames. But listen, you could have eaten the mushroom shake. I, you could have just sipped a little bit of it. Come on. Next time. And speaking of healthy food, click through to watch us eat an entire full course meal made of bacon. <laughs> Got a GMM fan in your life? Give them a gift card to our store. Available at, well, our store. That's mythical.store.